Baby, tell me what's your name Where you from and tell me Have you understood the game It's time for you to tell me and explain If you and me can be my lovers I feel my heart beating in my thigh And you know it is strange how, how it hangs But I want to tell you that doesn't matter what you think, cause we can be all the love. Lovers, 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 lovers. Even if you're pooping underneath covers, and even if you're scratching me with your dotted toes, baby, you know me, and you can be my all the lovers. Lovers, 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 lovers. Come on, under covers. See do the call, baby, even with your brother. It's alright if you know how to do it. I'll make your love. I think so. <laughs> Let's just be some lovers. Y'all, baby, let me tell you how I feel when I feel right here. I can get you down on my knees and I know I can't win. No, it's not a thing that I send a feel name. When I bet the throne of this, I'm a little on the end of my hand. And I send it to live in some chairs. When I get in the love in the mess, I'm on this. And I'm with the boys and I make you feel the toys. And you know the girl, I gotta send them and I make a noise. I'm a bit like, oh, and I wanna make you feel like it's right. Like you're squeezing me really, really tight, baby. When you know I'm doing it night, uh, it's a way I'm gonna get it ignited. If you wanna be more than lovers, come on, get underneath these covers. It might be soft, it might meet you, but we can bring my brother. Lovers, 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 come on, let's be more than lovers, lovers. Okay, I think I'm done now. <laughs> In the spirit of Valentine's Day, right? <laughs> Okay, the dangers of mixing your recreational medication with sugar and being early for your own show. That's <laughs> Bonjour, good afternoon, hello, can it meet you lemons? It is blessed to you are here so from Mexican join it. You are watching the Etienne David Live Daily with me, Etienne. And I can switch to a bay of bliss that you have come here to grip the DA for me, Biki, and live the here. And ook for me in the comment, I can share where from that come day. Is she lekker with your dog? Is she from the cap? Is she dog in the the cap? Is she from the other plank? Share for me, share for hello for the mansion. And uh, then we'll be starting with a very important subject. Yeah, I know it's about love. Talking about love, that's the story from what we be getting up above from the sun that's shining. It's a man, another f fantastic love story. It's music. I don't know about you, but I love music. It's like a thing for me. It, uh, I can't even understand. But I'm glad to have you here. Welcome. If this is your first time here, uh, please don't run away. I know it was kind of weird. Um, <laughs> I was just feeling it, okay? Love does that to you. H haven't you ever been like, just like, oh, man, you know, it doesn't make sense. I can just fart. And I still, like, I'm like, wow, you're the man. It's, it's insane. And, and I love this time I get to spend with you every single day at one o'clock. So it like charges me up and it makes things happen. Hey, you learn like my piano viva uh, because it's so amazing to be surrounded by people that share your light, share your care and concern for spreading love and that are reaching out to just connect. So we connect every day, we talk some stuff, we connect, we chat, we after the conversation. Sometimes it's quite raunchy, other times it's just for the sake of having a like a conversation. Uh, but we have a beautiful community that if you want to be part of, consider clicking on the link and joining our Telegram group where you can maybe be part of like exclusive stuff. But you have to eat in what that costs you only your data of the time that you probably would have spent on the toilet. So just you do that, consider that. Plus, if you're going to click there, you're going to see a whole bunch of other cool things like if you want to see the previous episodes. Or live specifically, you go to Oh, YouTube, and then we're going to be able to see how the house is lekker, me. I can do the half part and get to come to the door. I can get to the door of the door. I can get to the door of the door. Me, I can get to the door for four years. He's my convince me. I can see. I can. Magritte. I can't even 
بيسني ويل اك اك شنور انت اكنا نسو سايتين جيما اك شنور ني ان ان ديت خبير امر ماي بالاس دي خروت هيس انا سيك اوب ماي رغ لي دان دان ماك ماي بالاس ماي موت تو سو دي 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 لغ كاني لغ كفلي ني سين جاي سو جاي موت ماي بالاس فاسا سو في فير بلاري يار سلاب ايك مي دي مانسا ايرس ان ماي هانت سو دي تايدي كان شنور ني تو فند ايك ايت اي برا كاك Maar ik laat jou goed eten en ik heb een halfpad gemist, zo ik wil ook kijken, zo ik wat moet ik maken? Jij moet net klik voor mij op die link in mijn bio en dan ga je naar YouTube toe. Op YouTube? Ja, 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 op YouTube en dan zal jij zien daar, daar is een playlist van alle replays. Ik heb alles, alles wat jij zo'n plekje gaf, maar ook in de hoofdkant praat ik niet. Mensen hier, ik in, in kom ons praat met liefde, ik, mijn man moet worden. So you can, <laughs> stuff like that sometimes happens and we welcome it because I think it's probably what was supposed to happen anyway. But you can see all sorts of stuff there in the link, you can catch up the replays. And there's some income opportunities if you're looking for some remote work from home stuff. There's some stuff you can do there if you already work for someone, you're like, yo, I'm an expert in IT, I'm an expert in community service, I build infrastructures, I'm like involved in finance, whatever. There's some surveys that can pay you up to 250 bucks for 60 minutes. All that stuff is in the in the freaking bio. Now, if you are like anything like the people that have been, I feel they were standing with me in the queue. On Black Friday on on Voters Day and we just became like family. If you were one of those people, then you know that I don't really replicate a lot of what you see on this amazing app that is allowing us to connect uh, with phenomenal talent and amazing like-minded people in ways we've never been able to. Um, but I, I have included some specific things because there are some that have not ever, ever, ever seen this before, which is so fantastic because it means that because you are commenting, because you are sharing, because you're going out keys and there's other things that I'm also like discovering people are doing. Like yesterday, I'm like gifts. I'm like, what the hell is this? I'm like, oh my word, this is like money. People are throwing. Okay, sure. It's like the equivalent of throwing your ashtray change at a stripper in a strip club. But hey, it's it's not the intention of this thing, <laughs> but it's amazing that it happens and it's now allowing more of whatever the hell we're going to end up doing here reach more people that have never seen us before so or even heard about us or even heard about me or the things that happened here so so i do want to make sure that they understand that we do have offline conversations and that there's more than just some random rasta jesus looking guy talking random quickies and that is out here not making up words to, to stuff that he's clicking on because he's Music in the background. I don't want it to sound like this is a political party. And you must please come and follow me. Because every time you are clicking on that plus thing here, that plus thing, it, 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 it what the algorithm, the algorithm is picking it up. I don't know where I'm taking, but it's picking, so it's good. And when you're commenting, I'm a lippy lippy, uh, 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 what's that thing? Um, uh, smiling face. Uh, or anything like that, yeah, I'm showing up. Then more people is joining, so they are not me. Yeah, wait, wait, what's this thing? What's this person? What is happening here? And then all I can tell them is that all right, you can come here. We can learn to make some money. We can also give you opportunity for you to do such. If you want to work online, or if you want to work remotely, or if you want to just do some things on survey, you can do that. Or if you want to just connect with other like-minded people to continue conversations we've had there. Or even if you want to start new conversation, you can do this in, with us going on. What is that thing that? Uh, on the telegram group and you can do this by clicking links anyway that is enough of that so what we're talking about today is love la 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 story so yeah that's how i feel about love Woo -hoo -hoo. if you feel about love and your love story please let me know in the comments how you met your partner because we all know <laughs> I always love telling my love story. So I'll take short, just a little bit of a time. I'd like to tell you how I met my Dexel because I'm the port. Um, and I, I, I was, I was a bad relationships person for a very long time. Get some <laughs> My now wife had to deal with. 
but but I, I I was I was not so great at relationships. I was one of those like let me be in a long term relationship because I don't even really understand. If you don't know what I'm talking about, like go and watch a replay when I talk about like what it was like being a kid. It outlines where my 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 errors are, and I only realized it later in life anyway. But at this time. Uh, I was like not sure of what I wanted from a relationship, dude. I didn't even understand what I was offering. I couldn't just be like, "Hi, I'm Etienne. I sound like a call center team leader, and I have a penis." Which you like to this? What the fuck? What am I offering the world? Even that's the, uh, thank you for at least meeting minimum requirements, Etienne. Your penis is not big enough. Okay, you you have length, but you lack girth. And I feel, <laughs> sorry, I don't even. Uh, let's stop talking about my, anyway, not the video I'm saying, but I'm saying is like you, I had no idea. And, and in the relationships that I was in, I was with some incredible women who were maybe not aware of how much of the disaster that I was contributing to the reason why our relationships ended. They were actually helping the rest of womankind by fixing some of the shit that I was unaware of because amongst my brothers, amongst the comrades, amongst the people who were supposed to be pointing out the road for me as young boy to help me understand, okay, when you want to be with a woman, you cannot just say, hello, I have penis. My koi vota koi balshoi. It is not enough. You must do more. You have to have more than just house and car. None of the people, they would just say like, yo, bro, you got to get it, man. You got, there are, no matter what you do, son, you just got to get the numbers. Ignorant. Stupid. How, how diluted when it's not even really their own fault. It's just because of pre programming the way that society has positioned men in the, and how they've defined and described masculinity it's there for but that was like so and, and i'm a mess dude so i've been after when i'm not in a relationship you guys will unfollow me you will be like oh my so anyway, to list a the comment van ik alles wat op die blij geskryf het kal is dit die eneste ene wat hartetjes kry en extra replies en die manse video is net opgeblaas want hy praat enkel van hoe maak mens a peanut butter en apple sandwich maar hierdie comment is dit maar ek gaan nou moet nie ek gaan nou vir jou sê man so anyway nou lees ek die comment en die comment sê ja het hier is nice om te weet dat jy so voorgeef vir die mense na 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 ek Van Jay is nog al is so nie, van ek kan onthou in 2001, insert date here, was Jay moest nou die ou, en toe, wat is jy met my gemaakt? Jy my gebrekste vloer, like, girl, die enigste reden kom ek geophoud wees het, is omdat daar niks my characters voor die, yo, you're done, you're done, when I, 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 broken, and then being heartbroken, is a, that is a formula for disaster, so, as a single person, not a great guy and I was not doing a lot of justice to a lot of people I feel like maybe here and there there was because I was genuinely looking for what I thought was love because that's what we all think we're looking for we're like oh yeah I think there's a definition of what love is and this is where I should find it and how I should find it but it's not really the way it works and I just gave up I'm like you know forget about it where am I going to find people uh, I need to go online <laughs> I don't know what that sounds like. It's like, oh God, you know. But at this point, I had grown so much. I had learned so much from being an asshole and from trying to be a nice guy when I was, and a nice guy, please, just so that you can understand this, guys. If you are a nice guy that does not entitle you to automatically, like, oh, all the women's like, well, check it out, right? I, oh, yeah. It's a nice, yeah, it's a nice guy. It's okay. It's fine. I can say it's a nice guy. <laughs> yeah. Fuck that part in my French. Being a nice guy is not enough. You, you, that is like a default setting. You're supposed to be a nice guy. Don't be a doers. But but I learned while I was in a relationship where I was actually active and trying to keep it alive and working at it, because that's what a relationship is. I learned a lot of things. And I was at this time where I'm like, okay, 
I'm now, I need to find someone and I don't know what to do anymore. I'm terrible at this and this and this and this. So let me just be straight, be honest and genuine. And I put my stuff on. I don't know if you guys remember Baduna. Or if you're still on it, you know, this is what it was for. I didn't know. I I, I wasn't. I, I thought Badu was just like, oh, yeah, this is like colored Tinder. Salut for the mensa. We, we the mensa. But apparently it was uh, it was more like, oh, Badu, your cousin, your brother, your auntie, your mom, your dear, they Badu, everybody. So I didn't realize that. Um, sure, I should have read more. But I was more focused on like, you know what? I found how I can love myself. And I've understood what, at least for now, what loving myself looks like and what not loving myself looks like and what I can really say is my understanding of love for someone else and maybe even started understanding my love language. So it was like it like really the, 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 the baby, the embryo stages of me becoming a full functioning actual human being that is able to progress further than my own selfish desires and needs and I was like okay I'm gonna put down everything so I'm like this is where I look how stupid this was now I'm like I'm in my ignorance and my and my noviceness and my hopefulness as well I'm like okay so this is what's what I'm kind of like looking for because I know that's the principle of the app but I was like very specific about the things that I am also and what I'm looking for. And I'm like, okay, this is going to happen. Nothing happened. It, it took, so I'm like, okay, nobody's coming. <clears throat> nobody's coming my way. Uh, I think maybe I should start looking. And I did this and I, and I had a conversation and I met someone and we had a conversation. And it was like, not even like a, I'm looking for someone. It was more of a new understanding of the place that I've put my ego in because he was sitting right in the front for so long and that's why I was making such shitty mistakes because I wasn't living in balance and right now I was still getting close to balance but ego was at the back so I was still kind of like listening to like yeah 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 did you at least um and I had a conversation with this woman I looked at her pictures and I was like I'm I'm captivated I'm I, I I'm like whoa you know when when you we see this in the movies and you hear it in the movies they're like okay time slows down and it's not even like sexy music it's just like what's she doing oh no she's just like moving the hair out of her face and laughing <laughs> you know the sexy laugh they do on TV <laughs> like maybe taking a slicky of something everything slow and I can see all of this from like static photographs I felt this I don't know it was like it, it, I can't even describe what I could feel and I was like alright we got it and we started chatting we were chatting in in, in the in the inbox and I, I didn't even look at anyone else I wasn't even like considering Matt I'm just, no something feels right here and we ended up taking the conversation offline and my wife will tell you a different version of this because obviously She's not as like emotionally affected by what it felt like. But I, I was in the process of like really starting to gain a little bit more momentum in my stand-up comedy career. And I was participating in this like uh, stand-up competition and we were chatting for a while and that's it. Like we were just chatting and the conversations were like so easy. You remember Mix It we were talking about yesterday? Well, if you didn't catch yesterday's one, that's also in the thing. But like yesterday we were talking about Mix It being the original place to like those sneaky shady people would be at but you were also able to like hey what's up and how's it going cool I can message for like one cent please call me and all that um, it was it was like easy conversations those times where you were up all night and it's like okay okay no okay I'm gonna go, I'm gonna log off now no 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 baby no. Don't, I'll log off also okay I'll wait for you no man it was like the, that was the no you hang up no you hang up on <laughs> time and, and it was like, or uh, well, my time at least, uh, but it was easy to have that. And that was what it felt like with Nicole. I didn't know it was going to be my wife. So then we were chatting and then I was like, yo, so by the way, I'm like in this competition, you know, ego was like coming a little bit closer to being in balance. And I was like starting to learn how to actually start finding the strength to live in balance and where's ego's place and the rest of it. And I was like, hey, yeah. So by the way, I'm in this competition. Remember, he's fresh. I'm in this competition and I'm like in the finals and shit. And um, 
Yeah, you know, she's like legendary. She's like opposite of what I was expecting. It's like, oh sure, uh, that's insane. Oh, well, that's cool. Well, that's great, or something like that. Um, just uh, you better win, or otherwise, don't talk to me. I'm like, huh? What? Uh, I didn't even reply. I don't think. And I was like, okay. And I'm like, shit, okay, but this competition is like, and I'm like sitting with them, I'm like, we had a great, I feel like I know you, we connected, I feel, I've already fell in love with you, but I'm not saying anything about it, I haven't even convinced myself or told myself yet, but I can feel it, I can feel it first, I can feel it, I can, in my, everything, like from my balls to my bones, and I say my balls first, because let's be honest, the first time when you look at somebody, it's not like, yo, oh, my baru, look, kiki, yay, 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 yeah, man, yo, relax, man, but come you, yay, baby, since I go, I'm a blue up. Abri ba, ya man, wat a goes abri ba. Hy het nou my nie hoed op. Awe, die het nou my nie hoed op. Mene brein hare, awe, mene brein hare. Jo, my bro, ek is, ek is stom geslaan. Die goes lyk, so verantwoordelik. Ek gaan my na gaan praat. Awe, het jy moet gepraat. Never, ever, ever, ever. And please correct me if I'm wrong. Has a conversation ever gone. Snack, no, I like the plate, man. Yo, girl, fuck up, bitch. Oh, oh, fuck, take it, diva, fuck, take it, ah. Shoo! Oh, the fine special man. I'm like a special match. Since I owe too many tattoos, I owe many, like a long dread. Okay, the tattoos, you're not in. Like, just a teardrop move. But you're almost like a tick and die. Oh, look at him, where he is. Yo, he's up. Bitch, you're not. I go now with him to talk about how that guy looks like he's a fantastic conversation. I go now with him to talk about him. Hi. Never. The thing you say when you see somebody is like, Yo! The stuff I'm going to do to you when you walk into church on Sunday, you're going to bust into flames. That's the kind of thing you're thinking about. So yes, from my balls to my bones, I felt like this was my woman, this was my one. And I go to the competition. And I didn't win. I, I was crushed. You know what I did? I didn't talk to her at all. Months. I was fighting the urge to message this woman. But because she said, if you don't win, don't message me. I did nothing. I went to, on tour to Joburg. And while I was touring Joburg, I had a couple of go- bi- uh, gigs bicked. <laughs> I had a couple of gigs book but I was like literally fishing for more gigs not just like free shit to like hey oh, look here's a free guy there's a guy from Cape Town and Dinkton don't you like actually so you're like go oh, Etienne I saw what you did you're a fucking funny mother listen come on my stage I can't really pay you much I know the going rate at the moment is like ex- oh bro I can offer you so much exposure plus I'll at least give you a beer and a, and a burger or something to eat while you're there like, oh, that was what I was, like, my intention. And while I'm busy doing this, I was uh, performing at the Pop Art Theatre in Maboneng in Joburg. And it was my first stop. And the Goliath Brothers, back in the day, they still had the Melrose thing in the thing. Afterwards, the, the Donovan came just like, yo, are we, bro? You, you, you here for, um, for a while? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm here in Cape Town. And like, he's like, yo, swing by the club. I'm like, inside, I'm like, but like on the surface I'm like oh yeah yeah no cool yeah sure no problem bro you must just like let me know I'll I'll, I'll like inbox you or something and like and ben ek kant as ek bisag om te my penty si klam nie bra it was a thing that ek was so bloody excited I get to play the Goliath comedy club on my first time I'm touring Joburg to do comedy in any case are you kidding me yeah nigga and do it ek must carry just mander now that I can, now my wife can and I'm like, hey. Because of course, I'm too stupid to say something proper and significant. I, that's really a proper greeting. I'm like, hey. Um, so I know you said that I'm not supposed to I talk to you and car because I lost. <laughs> I shit you not. I'm, gonna, I'm thinking about doing a late, a late night live with Etienne and Nicole again, maybe on TikTok. So that you can, can I have my wife on and you can ask her yourself. But I was like, hey. I know, like you said, um, I wasn't supposed to like message you because I didn't win, but uh, I'm, I'm like touring Joburg. Then I kind of ducked. Even when I was typing it, it was like, I'm touring Joburg, and uh, like I just got told some really exciting news 
Uh, I get to play the Goliath Comedy Club. And because they saw my, my first night. <gasps> Little did I know, girlfriend was actually thinking of what did my deep brach of beardy burgers net M I A. Maybe he lost interest in 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 in. But so in actual fact, because because obviously she didn't know what I was feeling and what I was doing. I was just like having like playing a cool. Remember, look how I even acted when I got a, a opportunity of a lifetime to play a club that was iconic for a moment, even though COVID destroyed a lot of our live entertainment. The Goliath Comedy Club saw more African talent than anywhere else. Anyway, so it was phenomenal. I was inside, I was like, ah! But answer, yeah, yeah, no, no. So the same with Nicole, even when I was talking to her. So when I was now finally having, I'm like, no, I'm never gonna let her go. I'm never, this, this is not. Listen, Etienne, Etienne, listen to me, bro. I, I get it. I know we're broke. We have fuck all to our name. The only thing we can really offer is a smile and the fact that we are a smart enough person to try to navigate life and find the way to get the most value for everyone that we get in touch with. Okay, okay, cool. But I mean, I live in my car. Forget that. She knows you live. Fine. Okay. Okay. This is the only thing you have to do. You have to make sure that you are genuine, honest, and not hiding anything from her. And that you make sure that you meet her. We haven't met yet, by the way. So I, I come back from the thing. We meet three times. Everything that I said to myself was exactly what I did. I then told her my third time because I now went to Joburg for a second time to tour. I came back and I'm like, I'm, I, will you be my girlfriend? I know it's old school to be like, hi, listen, I like you and I like you a lot and I like spending time. Will you be my girlfriend? But I asked her. And a few months later, she moved with me to Joburg and we'll dive into that story a lot deeper. But it all started from me getting to a place where I started to understand what loving myself looked like by making sure that I re knew that the pain and the hurt and the not being loved that I felt and that I was experiencing before was influencing how I understood what loving myself was like. And if I wasn't able to deal with the things that caused the pain and the hurt and that shaped my idea of what love meant, I would never be able to express to someone else or even give them a chance to love me or learn to love me. So that was really important for me to get to. And then when I discovered what it meant to love myself and what my language was and that everybody else has different and everybody, then it, I became open to the idea of having someone else love me the way that they do. And when I made peace with those things, I was in a much better position to be like, I'm not looking for love. I am love. And who will share my love will find me. And we found each other in a way that I never thought was possible on an app where I even made a joke and I said that the reason why I joined this thing is because I saw that a lot of people or a lot of women were posing in the blowjob cramps position. I don't know if you know what the blow... Posing with the photos and like... And, and I think, I, I thought that was blowjob cramps. I'm like, hey! <laughs> See what I mean? How broken I was. Anyway, so... In the most unexpected ways, love finds you. The ultimate love, the absolute most fulfilling and satisfying, comforting and incredible love that you would ever feel or even thought that you might've felt, but it's nothing, 10 times that is waiting for you. But it starts with you learning how to love yourself. So that was my love story. I'd love to hear yours. Huh? And if I run out of time, which I hope I won't, because I'm going to go like a little five minutes extra. I've realized that's what happens with the live stuff. I can go 30 minutes plus five, and then they will be okay with it. So we will go till 10.35. So I'm going to read some comments, find out from you guys what's your love story. And if, if we didn't catch up, and if you maybe just jumped in and you missed most of what we're talking about, when you worry me, don't worry. It's going to love. Good you troll me in the link in my bio. <laughs> Oh, you can just click on the link that says YouTube and you can catch up some of this stuff. Tonight's episode, or this episode, will air tonight after our, uh, my princess goes to bed. I'd also like to invite you to join our community, our Telegram community, where we continue the conversation offline and we share ideas, share thoughts, make connections and continue to try to fight the fight of making the world a better place, not just for us and for the future generations, but for all human beings. Um, 
I do this every day, and today was love stories, and tomorrow's going to be something else. Every day is something different. But I love to have you share your thoughts, and that is the perfect way for me to get right into the commentarians. Uh, let's quickly go have a look. Naz, groet hulle prachtige mense, ach hulle jy vrou, dis naars. Ek is so blij die blij as jy bykom. Elke dag is jy hier, ek wonder wat dink die mense by die werk van jou. Hy is dat naars as aan my kaar op hoofd, he? Wat dink jy kyk sy? Nee, ek dink is dal pornografie. Nee, ek kan nie, dis is hy so redenklik. It's nice to have you, I love you, and I appreciate the support you give. Thank you for shining your light. Uh... For the, for love, the Ashanti. Hello, my people. How's it, girl? Nice to see you. Oh, uh, yeah. It's so nice to have you here. Um, Aisha, welcome. So nice to have you, too. Uh, we love the love. Feeling it with you, bro. No need to apologize. Thank you. Yeah, that's for, like, the singing stuff and whatever. Like, love is amazing. It makes you, makes you do stupid, ridiculously insane things that pushes you to a point where you're like, whoa, I'm actually capable of a lot more. And you can actually achieve so much more in love than you can with hate, even though the impact is so much more powerful on the short term. When you look at hate, it pales. It's got, it doesn't even get points on the board when you look at love. So I'm so, I love the fact that there's so much love here. And I mean, the Valentine's Day one day, screw it. We should love each other all the time. Um, Encourage your viewers to show that was TikTok. We don't need to talk to you guys. You don't need to be encouraged. Um, you know what you need to do here. Yeah. Ashanti, my auntie, Nazi Swift. You see, this is the kind of community. Like people know each other already. We we go here and in the Telegram group, and it's it's awesome. Selwyn September, welcome! Hello, Lekker. Look that man. This community is is the thing that gives me hope. And that really keeps me fired up and fueled to keep doing this. And that, like, just like between us, I am terrified by how excited I am for what's coming for all of us. Like the stories that have been waiting to be told. That are, oh, I, it's, and you're, you are, you are the, you're the author. Thank you. Thank you, Selwyn. How's it? E. E. D. Erectile dysfunction. <laughs> uh, that's just has something to do with your circulation, by the way. If you're struggling with your toli and your maniki and your swadaiki, have a look at your blood circulation and that kind of stuff. And your diet it's also very important. We'll help you with your honor. <laughs> I uh, hope you're all doing great. Can't wait for the weekend. Yeah, let us know what you have in the weekend. Sent a treasure box. Jade sent a treasure box. Oh, my word. A chance to come on. Oh, look at this. And thank you. Wow, I didn't, I didn't even see it. It's probably during one of those little internal monologues that you guys get to bear witness to. Wow, thank you so much. I appreciate it. It's not, it's, it is welcome with open arms and received with the love that it was sent. Thank you. And I've come to a place where I've, I've, I have embraced being grateful and accepting gifts. So thank you. This is the way that the universe does things. Like you, you really, you set your life up by setting up your mindset, by framing your perspective and by making a choice every single day. Sometimes those choices are so hard. Harder than like, damn it, I don't want to get out of bed. Harder than like, ah, oh, shit, I don't, want, I don't want to actually try. Harder than like, do I really want to go to work? But you can do it because you've done it before. You've just forgotten because you sometimes get so close to the thing that's hurting you or the thing that's keeping you back that you forget how powerful you are. And love is a way to unlock that. If you start rooting everything in love, love will be returned. Not just in money and in things and whatever, but you will feel it. And there's nothing better than that because then you will emulate it and shed it and shine that light and it shines so much brighter and other people will be intoxicated by it. Our community is an example of that. It in just confused me slightly. Uh, okay, I'll probably... <laughs> sorry, hello, yellow. Hi, gorgeous. Don't be confused. Watch, learn, and be <laughs> Love is one crazy thing, but it's not enough, though. True. Please also, don't misunderstand. I don't mean that this is like the one answer. I don't, I'm not a believer in a magic cure. Uh, I might be idealistic in my thinking and in my uh, principles or my viewpoint, but I'm, I'm, I'm completely aware 
that love is not enough. I know us having a conversation about, and I'm gonna even just like give you the taste because you're here. So tomorrow, what we're gonna be exploring is rape culture and the fact that it's a culture. Are you kidding me? What? Anyway, but we can do what we can to have the conversations. We can do what we can to try to extend the knowledge, to share what we've learned, to point people in the right direction, to speak for the ones that can't speak, even if it's through an example or a scenario or a own experience or whatever, an interpretation. We can do all of that, but it's still not enough. It's still not enough. It's a, it takes more. It, it, I, have you heard that expression when it takes a village to raise a child? It takes more than one person to change the world. It takes more than a great idea to build a business. It takes more than your commitment. It takes more than your talent or your passion to become successful. It, it's, it's all I want to do. And I'm sure you'll probably figure that out or not figure that out. You'll see that in the, in the subtext of what I do is I just want you to start. I want you to take the first few steps in knowledge, in yourself, in belief, in faith, in exploration, in trust, in recovery, in understanding, in connection. I just want you to take the first few steps and to take it with people that are also taking the first few steps that are helped and guided by people that remember what it was like to take the first few steps. But you are 100% correct. It's not enough, but it's a start. Like I said yesterday, you, you don't need to be great to start, but you need to start to be great. I love that quote. Uh, sent finger heart. I, I fingered heart the old work. Yeah, that doesn't sound right in Afrikaans. I finger heart you too. Yeah, but a lot of people don't get that. Yeah, net the plump perves. I must say I've poked, poked my husband on Facebook. <laughs> uh, then that same day he asked me out and boom, five years married. Kijk nou daar, you poked each other, wie gesê, steek is neek. <laughs> Don't knock it. If you're single and you're watching this and you're like, oh, whatever, this is like, this is the exception, I'm the rule, this never happened to me. The place you least expect it, the thing that you are saying won't work or the thing that you haven't even tried yet because you're not even willing to do it is the thing that could possibly work for you. Ah, uh, Shanti, haha, the best. Okay, let's get to the last few comments due to the age difference. He would hide in the booth and I would sneak him in while I'm <laughs> You are dating the boot of the bar, the Arama man. Oh, that's ridiculous. Yes, the boot of the car. I know! The things we do. I slept in my car in front of Nicole's house so that I could be close to her. What is wrong with this guy? I'm sure it was easy because I'm living in the damn thing, but still. Love, bro. Lost interest, emotional damage. Emotional damage. You know that as damaged as it can be, it can be repaired. It won't be the same, but it can be repaired. And you can learn to love again. It doesn't mean that you won't be affected or changed by what hurt you in the first place, but you can learn and have an enriching experience and still embrace love. Join our offline chat. I'm going to scroll for the hell. i second off snake. So true. Love teaches you a lot of things. Yes. So let's do a quick shout out here. Uh, Tammy Smith. Uh, the Ash Jade, welcome. I know you were here already. Ashanti Naz. Thank you. Selwyn. Yes, amazing. Hey, Makey, my sister. Go check her stuff out. If you want to go and look at some DIY and stuff and stuff. You also say. Nice to have you, Amaya. I love you so much. Love to uh, the family on that side. To so the Felixes. So much respect. Uh, let's see who else is. Rosie. Welcome in, Rosie. Uh, welcome in. Cloud Guild. Welcome to this. I'm sure you probably missed so much and you don't know what's going on. I apologize that you've just come here and said we're about to end. I appreciate the conversations and the comments and you're having your thoughts. If you want to continue on the conversation, click the link in my bio, join our Telegram group, and let's continue talking. Uh, if you missed most of it, you're like, what the? F what? What happened? Ah! Uh, did it even? You can catch the replay <laughs> if you click on the link in my bio and you go to the one that says YouTube later tonight. You can catch tonight's episode or today's episode, which will be uploaded after everything happens and quiets down in my house. 
uh, but you can also catch up on the others that have also been out. Uh, we will be doing this every single day. Tomorrow's the last day, one o'clock, where we'll be talking about, you've heard me say it, so if you've missed it, go check out what I said in the YouTube replay. So it's just so fabulous to have all of you here. I just want to say to all my community, um, as genuinely and as authentically as I can, I hope that you can feel all the positive, love-driven intentions that I'm sending your way that I don't even know whether you need it or not. But I'm sending it your way because I've, I've received the ones that you've sent to me conscious and unconsciously. And I just want to thank you and embrace you and look forward to the journey of what's lying ahead and what we're going to do. So see you tomorrow. Consider joining the community and... Uh, Thank you for being here live. Okay, now you're in. My big crack, drug. You're in, Klein. I'm done.